thank you everybody today for joining this wonderful event uh, where we're going to talk about how you as a business can accelerate your cloud journey with Microsoft Azure. It gonna give you a lot more confidence to migrate to Azure and uh, we will learn how we're going to plan your Azure strategy in near future. Uh, what are the full power of Azure for your productivity? How it's going to reduce your cost and in the end help you become more efficient. So uh, we have Q&A section over here with us. So if during this webinar anybody is having some, any questions, so feel free, free to post your questions over there and we will take the question and answer session in the end. All right, so um, I have Ramon with me, who is our Azure specialist and consultant. Uh, Azure, uh, Ramon, off to you. Thank you, Atul. Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, welcome to this uh, Microsoft-led partner Azure webinar. I'll be your presenter today, and today's danger, I'll be presenting you on uh, why migrate to the cloud, why particularly Azure, benefits of Azure, and how Microsoft and Computer Solutions East can help you with the transition and migration as well, and how can you participate with the Microsoft program. So uh, let's get started today. Uh, moving on to the slides. Every company, regardless of industry, legacy, or technology pedigree, can thrive in the cloud. So this presentation paints a picture of uh, the cloud landscape and explains in clear and basic terms on how Microsoft Azure can solve complex business problems while also making new business models possible. So this has never been a better time to spring clean all your apps, data, and infrastructure, and also migrate them to the Azure cloud. 2020 will be a big year for cloud migration. Organizations are moving to the cloud because of its scalability, economy, and reach. And they're using several metrics to measure the resulting business value of cloud. So cloud advantages have proven to be especially valuable as organizations have had to adapt nearly overnight to the work at home explosion intensified by COVID-19. So according to Gartner's latest worldwide public cloud services revenue forecast, infrastructure as a service will outpace the overall market and is forecasted to grow 17% in 2020 to total of like 266.4 billion, up from 227.8 billion in 2019. Also, clearly organizations are increasingly turning to infrastructure as a service, which includes anything from migrating your existing applications to moving your entire data centers to the cloud IAS. So Gartner estimates more than 80% of the CEOs will be pressured by business managements to evaluate migrating their data centers to cloud IAS. So infrastructure as a solution is most frequently used for new workloads for agile IT, but an increasing number of organizations are also using the cloud IAS for reliable IT workloads due to its inability also uh, to reduce the cost and increase efficiency. So moving on to the next slide, why Microsoft Azure? So we are living in an age of breathtaking transformation where cloud technology is at the core of how the world will do business. So the cloud is unlocking the power of freedom to achieve success. However, you define it. I mean, we hear a lot of there is amazing technologies, but there is so much pressure as an IT person in an organization. Number two is I'm supposed to know all this new stuff and I, I can't keep up. As a developer, my team thinks I'm going to hit it out of the park all the time. There's very little room for failure now. And most importantly, uh, the security there, a lot of new things to take advantage of, but am I doing it in a way that is correct and secure? So these are, these are the real concerns beneath uh, the technology, and that is where Azure, the cloud that can make it possible for all the organizations. For us, it's all about guiding you through the journey of cloud, not just providing the technology. So the next slide, uh, it's a small video where we show a few companies uh, share their uh, uh, reactions and you know, advantages and benefits with the Azure cloud. 
So let's go on and uh, quickly share this video. Mars is a great company with a value proposition for consumers that is all about fun and joy. So our infrastructure has to scale up quickly without a big capital investment. We moved our first live production application into Azure, the SAP instance that runs our retail business, as well as about 100, 150 other workloads are sitting up in Azure today. We expect that to grow to five or 600 workloads over the next year. We wanted to make it really easy for our customers to get meaning out of their data. The industrial internet of things is different only in the fact that our customers have very stringent requirements about how data moves. We want one place to egress that data that we can lock down. The advantage of it being Azure is IoT Hubs makes it very easy to get that data in. Power BI makes it very easy to visualize that data once it's there. It allows us to put a data scientist in a box. Walking Dead No Man's Land is based on the AMC TV series. We can actually provide new content after each episode within 24 hours. I pretty much knew that with choosing Azure and Microsoft, I would be guaranteed with better support than I would get from any other cloud providers. We know that there's somebody there looking after us. In Azure, we have, I don't know how many hundreds of servers, but then again, why would I care? It's cloud. Microsoft helped us achieve our digital transformation. It's put us over the top. Geico's been growing leaps and bounds, and we have not had any issues whatsoever from a capacity perspective because of the on-demand capability and scalability of Azure. We can handle the volume. We're like, bring it on. We want more. Thank you, guys. And that's the end of the video. So many companies have expressed their views on uh, digital transformation and how Microsoft Azure is help, helping them drive the businesses. So let's move on with the next slide. Sorry about that. Azure Cloud for All. I mean, as you see, these three pillars represent the main value proposition for what differentiates Azure from the competition. As you can see in the proof points, these are the real reason why customers choose Microsoft because of the unique value that we provide in a productive, intelligent, and trusted cloud. So with Azure, you can do or be all of these things. Get unparalleled developer uh, productivity with integrated tools from mobile DevOps to serverless computing. Also create intelligent app that delight the data-driven experiences. So you can go quickly from concept to release with Azure data services and artificial intelligence from image recognition to the bot services. Also join the startups government and the 90% of the Fortune 500s that trust the Microsoft Cloud for security, privacy, transparency, and most importantly, the compliance coverage of any cloud provider. So let's dig in deep with the productivity, what Azure Cloud can bring you with. I mean, to, to be successful in the cloud era, enterprises must have visibility and controls on every component to pinpoint issues efficiently. Also, optimize and scale effectively as well. So while having the assurance, the security compliance and the policies are in place to ensure the velocity. As you can see the slide, the Azure portal, with the Azure portal, you get the enterprise gate uh, management capabilities built in within the platform, all the service all the resources together in a single easy to use portal. You can create dashboards, use the friendly search and intuitive menus. Also quick start resources and the templates and much more. With the single platform, you get integrated and interconnected tools and the data with unified metrics and alerts across your services. So you don't have to go to different portals with different data sets. It uses the out-of-the-box tools like Azure Advisor, Azure Service Health, and the cost management and billing. You can optimize and right-size your investment and get personalized recommendations to enhance your experience. There are five areas of security and management where you can secure with the Azure uh, trusted and secure platform, 
you as a customer have your own security settings you need to manage. You also need to be able to protect your individual machines against threats and monitor the security posture of your system. Also, your virtual machines and applications in the cloud need to be backed up and protected in the event of data loss with disaster recovery from on-premise to the cloud or from one cloud to another, you can avoid downtime and keep your applications up and running. Every operations manager and every developer needs to be able to see the health and the performance of their applications, infrastructure, and network. And seeing insight across all, the, all these three things together in a single dashboard can save time and resources. Also, more importantly, preventing issues in the near future. For managing Azure and hybrid workloads at scale, automation and configuration capabilities help you create runbooks to automate tasks. Also, manage the configuration settings and track changes and monitor and deploy the missing updates as well. Additionally, in Azure, you can use PowerShell and Cloud Shell as the command line scripting. So many customers need to weigh a way to look across the cloud resources and to assess the enforce enterprise-wide standards and policy compliance for security and management. In addition, they need to manage and monitor cost of the cloud, not just Azure, but in other clouds too. Lastly, Azure gives you the flexibility to manage your hybrid environments uh, with the most of these services, and you can choose which areas to invest more in and how much to consume. With Azure, you have the flexibility to choose what and how to manage your IT. So that's about the slide about uh, the intelligence. We talk about the intelligence is in addition to having your traditional on-premise enterprise data tools, such as SQL Server, Azure provides SQL services that connects the data to artificial intelligence services. So this enables quickly adopting to technologies such as uh, deploying a global mobile application that integrates with facial recognition services. The ease of integration enables anyone to build a solution like that. From bot frameworks to cognitive services, you can fundamentally change the way your business goes to market with Microsoft Power Artificial Intelligence Platform. Going on to the next slide is the compliance and trust, which is not an after, after, afterthought with Microsoft. I mean, Microsoft are leaders in, in this space and uh, help set standards for global as well as federal organizations around the world. Microsoft has also been talking about the cloud uh, for a while and it, it will continue to do so. This is only the sampling of the compliance certification and Microsoft run the gamut. Azure strengths are around security, privacy, transparency, and how uh, Microsoft run the cloud as well. So Azure is continuing expanding its uh, infrastructure footprints around the cloud. In fact, Microsoft is the first cloud provider to put data centers in South Africa. Right now, Microsoft has around like 60 plus Azure regions, which, has, which is more than AWS and Google combined. So the approach Azure takes is different uh, as it is important for enterprise customers to have data in region close to employees, close to customers, as well as have a unique data handling capabilities as well. And finally, the Azure Security Center. Understanding security state across on-premise and cloud workloads, and also find vulnerabilities and remade it quickly. So you can uh, also limit your exposure of threats, detect and respond swiftly to attacks using the Microsoft Azure Security Center. So that's about the productivity, intelligence, and trust of the Microsoft 360, uh, Microsoft Azure Cloud. And moving on to the next slide, we're going to talk about what are the specific uses of cloud. I mean. You can keep your business secure and uh, with the new which we can create new applications, digital uh, services, store back, uh, store your data, back up your data and recover them whenever needed. And also uh, unlock the potential of connecting devices 
with artificial intelligence and much more i mean these are some just some basic uh, uses of cloud i mean apart from that you can do so much more so let's talk about the the benefits of the cloud time confidence and performance so what exactly uh, uh, how how does the cloud save time so you can get a new server in minutes uh, as opposed to months with something like azure virtual Ma machines you can also reduce the amount of time it spends having it having to do manually monitor as well as manage all the virtual machines using the tools in azure in addition to saving time you also want confidence you want to know uh, that when you put your business in the cloud it will always be available so with the azure site recovery you can rest assured knowing we ensure business continuity Azure, Azure Site Recovery orchestrates and manages disaster recovery from Azure VMs on on-premises VMs as well as the physical servers. So you can lower your on-premise infrastructure costs by using Azure as a secondary site for conducting business during outages or eliminate the data center cost altogether by moving to Azure and setting up disaster recovery between Azure regions as well. So you can pre-assess the network storage and compute resources needed to replicate applications from one premise to Azure. And the pay on only to you only pay to the compute and storage resources needed to run the apps in Azure during the outages. So Azure site recovery is backed up by 99.9% .9 SLA and 24 by seven support to keep your enterprise running and smoothly. You can also mitigate risk with Azure Security Center, huge breadth of security certifications, or you can choose to store your data in any one of the Microsoft 60 data center locations to keep it close to you. Lastly, you, you wanna know uh, you're investing your time and confidence into a platform that's performing better than you can do yourself. You can stay up to date with the latest Azure portal so you know, never have to update the software yourself. All the latest and the greatest tools are at your fingertips all the time. Also, you can simplify your devices with pre-configured solutions we have in our Azure IoT platform which allows you to take our performance and bring your business to another level. So accelerate your Azure migration initiative with the skilled migration expertise like Computer Solution Seized. So what can Computer Solution Seized do for you? We can help drive migration initiatives, manage your resources, which is already there on Azure. If not, we can also help you in, in planning and managing all the technical consultations as well as execution with the industry uh, uh, certified, Microsoft certified Azure personnel as well. So let's let's see how computer solutions east can help you with this so there are some programs there are some microsoft programs which helps you to move to migrate to azure cloud and azure services so microsoft planned the entire migration journey into four different phases with this we can make sure to migrate your data and server to azure cloud without any downtime and seamlessly as well so as you can see the Azure workshop. I mean, we can do a workshop and provide details over the Azure components and with the recommendations as well. We can also give you a business value, what we can compare with your existing on-premise environment with the Azure cloud. And the migration plan, we can, this computer solution CS can do an IT environment and assess all your requirement, also provide architectural solution in identifying like what needs to be migrated and how much data and give you that project plan as well. And also uh, we can do the complete proof of concept. Like this could be, this could vary from five days to two months, depending about the virtual machines and the data you have uh, on your on-premise to be migrated on the cloud. Apart from this, we also provide services in just backing your on-premise to the cloud and also the Azure site recovery in, in case of any uh, natural calamities. So these programs will help you in transitioning to Azure Cloud smoothly 
also oh, more importantly microsoft funds the pro partners and with uh, with that we we can help you provide your discounts on these services all you have to do is let us know what workshop you would are interested in if not let's just drop an email to us how do you get started is just phone call or email to us directly and we will be able to assist you and a microsoft certified engineer would reach out to you schedule a call and discuss about your requirements and also using these programs you will be able to avail up to a 50% discount on the above services and that to partnering with computer solutions is so as you can see please call us on 914-355-5800 and the email address would be info at computer solutions east.com so now the time for questions and answers so let me know guys uh thank you ramon for this wonderful presentation today it i'm um, 100 sure that all of our attendees today uh they are able to get more insights about azure and it definitely going to help them you know move with more confidence so let's take a look at the questions some of the questions that we have from our attendees uh, yeah, Patel, I second. just wanted to put this to you and all the attendees there. This is just the the capabilities are more. I mean, this is to get started. I mean, if any of the attendees are waiting to schedule a call, just have to schedule, and then we will be able to give them complete information in specific uh, requirement of theirs. Yes, yes, definitely. So uh, we don't have many questions uh, as of now. I have only one question for you, Ramon. One of the attendee name mr j he is asking why should i use microsoft azure as an msp over amazon web services so basically it's a question of directly competing with aws so ramon yeah sure thanks at the like and definitely assist and uh, j when comparing with amazon web services over microsoft azure i mean you need to know about the expense what it in incurs as well aws is five times more expensive than microsoft azure apart from that uh, uh, you also like get the ex ex existing windows server and sql server licenses with software assurance to pay and also reduced rate moreover uh, you get free extended security updates more than 90% uh, 90% of the fortune 500 companies use microsoft azure so i can definitely uh, send you all the information with regards to this jay and keep you posted Great. Uh, let's just wait for a couple of more minutes to see if any more questions are coming from our attendees today. Sure. Guys, this is the time. Please uh, don't hesitate to ask any questions. We'll be more than happy to answer all of your questions today. And uh, if there will be something else, we are just an email or call away. Okay, so one Harry, he has a question. Ramon, so he's asking, can we use Office 365 license in Azure to license the Office basically? Yep, that's a good question. You can actually use Office 365 license to like, you know, install version of Office on virtual desktops running Azure. So the Office uh, Pro Plus, which is the license I'm talking about, supports shared computer activation functionality and which is necessary to install and the license office is on Azure. So that is a yes. Great. So let me just quickly check if there are any more questions. Uh, nope. And I think we are over and above our allocated time. I would like to thank all of our attendees once again. Um, I hope you all got some uh, good insight from today's webinar. We look forward to working with you guys soon. Thank you. Thank you, Ramon. Thank, thank you, everybody. You, Have a thank good you one. All. Bye. Take Stay care. safe. Have a good day. Yeah.